dear students, our lesson today about defining and non-defining attributes of 2D shapes. Let's start. The essential understanding for this lesson is two-dimensional shapes have attributes that define them and make them different from one another. Previously, students used attributes such as the number of sides and the number of vertices to define two-dimensional shapes. In this lesson, students extend this work as they differentiate between attributes that do and do not define a shape. This problem is key because it requires students to consider which attributes define a triangle and which attributes do not. Listen and look for students who say that the figures are not the same kind of shape because they are different colors and sizes. Remind these students that two-dimensional shapes can be defined by the number of straight sides and vertices. Have students count the number of straight sides and vertices each figure has. Then, ask them to tell what these figures all have in common. Listen and look for other students who say that the figures are all the same kind of shape because they are all closed figures with three straight sides and three vertices. They may even name the figures as triangles. Listen for some of these students to point out that the shapes have different colors, sizes, and position, but all of them are triangles. These students understand that two-dimensional shapes have some attributes that define them, such as the number of straight sides and vertices. They also have other attributes, such as color, size, and position, that do not define what shape they are. Understanding the attributes that define two-dimensional shapes will help students create the shapes. So now we can divide we can divide 2D shape with um, the number of its sides or the number of its vertices, but we cannot define it with its color or its size or anything else. So here we have a question it says that circle the words that are true for each shape. All triangles are or have three sides or have three equal sides, or are tall or orange. Who said all triangles are orange? No, not all are orange, and color is not defined. Our triangles are tall? Mm, no, because size um, doesn't define all triangles. Have three equal sides? Not all triangles have three equal sides. Have three sides, yes. So we'll put a circle here on three sides, like this. Another question. Circles. All circles are blue. Color not defined. Have zero vertices. Yes, all, all circles have zero vertices. Are small. No size. Size doesn't define. Have zero straight sides? Mm, yes. So we'll choose here have zero vertices and zero straight sides. Are these all the same kind of shape? Let's find out. How are these shapes alike? One way they are alike is they all have four sides and four vertices. They are also all closed shapes. How are these shapes different? They are different colors and sizes. They are also in different positions. Shapes are defined by the number of straight sides and vertices, and whether they are closed or not. This is a closed shape. It has four vertices and two pairs of sides that are the same length. 
What is the name for a shape that is a closed figure and has four vertices and two pairs of sides that are the same length? This shape is a rectangle. Are all of these shapes rectangles? Question here. Select your answer. Are all of these shapes rectangles? What's a rectangle? A rectangle is a shape or closed shape has four sides and four vertices. Is it a rectangle? Is it a rectangle? Is it a rectangle? So the answer will be yes. They all are rectangles. Yes, they all have the traits needed for rectangles. Why are these shapes not the same kind of shape? This shape has four sides and four vertices. This shape has no vertices. This shape has six sides and six vertices. Shapes are not defined by color. Even though the shapes are the same color, they are not the same kind of shape. These shapes are all blue, but there is a rectangle, a circle, and a hexagon. What is each of these shapes? How do you know? These are all rectangles. Each one is a closed shape with four sides and four vertices. Two pairs of sides on each shape are the same length. Are all of the rectangles in the same position? No, they are not all in the same position. Are all of the rectangles the same size? No, they are not all the same size. Does size or position determine if the shapes are rectangles? No, shapes are not defined by size or position. Now you know which attributes define shapes and which attributes do not. So now you can answer this question. Tim says that this is a, a triangle. Is he correct? Is that triangle? And tell why and why not. Is that triangle? No, that's not triangle. Why? Because the object has three sides, but it is not closed. It's not closed shape. So it's not triangle. It has three sides, but not closed shape. So that's not triangle. Another question. Do all triangles have equal sides? And we said it before. Do all triangles have equal sides? Is it yes or no? I want to choose a tool to show how you know. Let's find the answer. Question here. Do all triangles have equal sides? Yes or no? And I want to choose a tool to show how you know. First, I will choose here triangle like this and put it here. It seems to be equal sides. What about another triangle like this one? And I will take it like this. We have here different sides. Not all sides are equal. Like this one. And another triangle. With different sides. So our answer here will be no. You can see here we have three triangles. Not all are equal in size. Maybe this uh, triangle are equal in size, and we call it equilateral triangle, and this one not equal in all sides, and you can see here not all the sides are are equal. So we will choose no. We will put a circle here. Okay. Which tool 
we can use to measure the sides of um, this triangle. We can use ruler. We can use ruler. So I can write here ruler like this and put it here. So our tool here is ruler. So with another question, Jax says both of these shapes are hexagons because they are closed and have six straight sides and are red. Do you agree with this? Number one are closed. Yes, they are closed. The second one have six straight sides. Yes, excellent. And the third one are red. And this um, is not defined any shape. So we said before the shapes are both hexagon because they are closed and have straight sides. That's enough. Not because they are red. We said before color don't define don't define any shape. Don't define any shape. So the another question match its shape with the words that describe a rectangle. A rectangle has three vertices or four vertices or no sides or Vertices, yes, four vertices. Second one, circle has three vertices or no sides or vertices. Yes, no sides or vertices. Triangle has three vertices. So the correct answer is here. Don't forget our homework, thanks, dear students.